Isaac, it's me. I wish I could talk to you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about everything. I wish I could just talk to someone. It's all falling apart here. I can't believe what's happening. It's strange. Such a little thing. God, I can't believe you made it. Isaac, <laughs> we ran to more of them on the way over here. Are you okay? More what? What the hell are those things? Is that the crew? Keep your voice down. Whatever they are, they're not friendly, and half the doors on this ship are locked because of the quarantine. Now, we have to get to the bridge, but first, we gotta repair the tram system. You're crazy, Hammond. You're gonna get us all killed. If you listen to me, I will get you out of here alive. Now, what's wrong with the tram? The data board is fried, but there should be a spare in the maintenance bay. There's also a broken tram blocking the tunnel that needs to be repaired. Damn it! Everything is on the other side of this quarantine. We can't reach it from here. No, we can't. But you can. Isaac, if I can get to the bridge, I should be able to access the personnel files. You fix the tram, and I'll help you find Nicole. That's it, Isaac. Take the board back to tram control and slot it into the computer array. That should get the tram system back online. Isaac, you did it. The tram is blocking the whole system. When you get the computer online, you'll be able to call the tram from the control room. Faster the better. I can hear something crawling around out there. All right, we're on board and heading to the bridge. Good work. Strange. The quarantine just lifted. Whatever was in the flight lounge must have left. That's lucky for us. Isaac, get back to the Kellyon and prep it for launch. We'll find out what we can from the bridge and meet you there. If we live that long, you're out of your league, Hammond. This is suicide. We're going your to die out here. Your lack of confidence in me is duly noted, Miss Daniels. But I have a mission to complete, and that's exactly what I am going to do, with or without you. Do we understand each other? Just get us out of here alive. What the hell is happening down there? What happened to the shuttle? That was our ride home. It's the only way off the ship. Kendra. No, Hammond! This changes everything! Just let me think. Can you access the command computer? It's no good. There's an executive lockdown of all primary systems. Without the captain's authorization, I can't access them. Well, where's the captain? Here he is. Captain Benjamin Mathias. Location? Med lab. Status? Deceased. What? How? I can't access that information. Find the captain and you'll find his rig. With his authorization codes, I can crack this computer wide open. Damn it. Isaac, I'm sending the tram back to your location. Get to the medical deck and find that rig as fast as you can. What was that? Isaac, it's me. I wish I could talk to you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Bella. I love you. It's all falling apart here. I can't believe what's happening. It's strange. Such a little thing. Isaac, it's Nicole. I wish I could just tell you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about everything. You've fallen apart here. I can't believe what's happening. That's strange. Such a little thing. Isaac, are you there? We were attacked. Kendra's gone. One minute she was there, and 
I, I can't believe I lost her. We can still do this. Get me the captain's rig codes and we'll find Nicole. Looks like the crew barricaded the door to the emergency wing. We have to blow through it to get to the morgue. Get some thermite from medical storage and a shock pad from zero G therapy. Should be down the corridor. God, communication is useless in all this static. What in God's name is going on down there? I think that's precisely the point, Doctor. God's work. I'm not so sure of that. We have to assume that the colony's problems are somehow connected to the marker. You can assume all you want to. I do not. The marker is glorious and divine. You... you know that. God moves in mysterious ways. Anyway, we'll have it on board tomorrow. You can analyze it all you want to. What are you so worried about? Worried? Captain, people are dying down there, killing each other. Is this madness the transformation unitology teaches us? Doctor. Terence. There will always be risk when the stakes are high. And here, they're enormous. It could change everything. And that's what worries me. This is Senior Medical Officer Nicole Brennan transmitting ship wide. We need more help. We don't have the resources to deal with this many cases. Nobody would tell us what's happening. These wounds. We are not equipped to deal with this. God. Get him to the table. Hold him. Nurse, you hold him down. Every quarter. Isaac. Somehow one of them found a way down to the captain's nest. I managed to contain it in a damaged escape pod. Lifting executive lockdown now. I found the deck logs. Whatever is happening around here, it came from the planet when they cracked it open. It spread to the colony and reached the ship. Isaac, this isn't an infection. It's some form of alien life. Shit, we've got bigger problems. The ship's engines are offline and our orbit is decaying. Get over to the engineering deck ASAP while I stay here and figure out what the problem is. You've got two problems and we're working on borrowed time here. First, there's no fuel in the engines. Second, the gravity centrifuge is offline, which means there's a couple of trillion tons of rock pulling us down. I need you to get that centrifuge operational. Refuel the main engine and fire it up so I can stabilize the ship's orbit. Isaac, can you hear me? It's Kendra. They attacked me, I ran for it, and Hammond just... He just disappeared. Kendra? Where are you? Nice to see you're alive and well, Hammond. I barricaded myself in the computer core. I can hear them moving outside, but I don't think they know I'm in here. I can log into everything from here. I hacked the root and found some reports from the colony. Even before they cracked the planet, the colonists were experiencing widespread dementia. It seems to be related to some artifact they found on the planet. Something called the marker. I'll keep looking. I've got your location and I'm going to unlock the door to fuel storage. You can get to the engine chamber from there. It's working. We're online and functional. Finally, some good news. Get a tram to the bridge, Isaac. I'm going to take us back into a geostation. Wait, wait, we're not safe yet. The ship's asteroid defense system is offline. On the way up, the ship's going to pass through a debris field thrown up from the planet crack. We'll be ripped to pieces unless you restart it. God damn it! I'll start working on it from here. Isaac, meet me at the bridge. You can do more good here than I can. Isaac, come in. Kendra's right. The ADS is completely shot. I'll need your help to fix this. Kendra, if you can hear me, see if you can get into the ship's reports. It sounds like you have better access from there. When were you going to tell us about the artifact, Hammond? This marker? I don't know anything about that. It's referenced in the captain's records. They brought it up from the planet. It's on the ship? In cargo. They think it's of alien origin, but I don't know what the hell it is. Really? CEC didn't know anything about it? You're lying. Back off! I am not the bad guy here. We're all shaky right now. You're going to have to trust that I don't know anything about it. We've entered the debris field. Get to the captain's nest. I'll explain everything later. Hammond down. 
This is mutiny. You'll all be tried for mutiny. Kind, make them listen to reason. Settle down, then. Hold him. By Maritime Law, Article 5469, I hereby declare Captain Benjamin Mathias unfit for duty. The marker must be delivered to the church. Terence, please. I'm sorry, Ben, but I can't let you do this. Traitor. Heretic. Hold his head. Murderer. Hold him. Dead. No, it was an accident. I, I had to stop him. Arrest the doctor. Wait! Isaac Hammond, you're not going to believe this. Oxygen levels are falling. Something's poisoning hydroponics air production, and whatever it is, it's filling the deck up with that organic stuff. We're not going to have any air to breathe soon. But if I understand these lab reports correctly, I think I can make a poison to destroy it. Head to medical. It should have everything you need. Will this never end? Isaac, get to medical and mix together whatever Kendra's come up with. I'm heading to hydroponics. If I can slow it down, that might keep us breathing long enough to fight it. Oh, shit. Isaac, I can smell the contaminated air from here. It's spreading faster than I expected. I'm trying to isolate it, but it's not going to buy us much time. We have to get that thing off this ship. The chemicals you need are in the chemistry lab. I'll hack the door for you when you get there. That's it, Isaac. Now you just need to- This has gone far enough. Accept your part in the God's plan. Embrace your own extinction. Life support system failure on medical Who deck. Who the hell was Please that? Please evacuate immediately. Isaac, he's decompressed the entire deck and I'm being locked out of those systems. All the air has been vented into space. You should be able to bring it back online from the security station, but you don't have much time. Let's just hope that's the last we see of that thing. I've managed to override Mercer's lockdown. There's a secondary tram station nearby and you can take it to hydroponics. Let's just hope there's enough time. Hammond! I thought you were dead. You need to get to cleaner air. You're not going to be able to help Isaac in your condition. Isaac, I'm scanning the area now. He's right, there's something really big in food storage. But I can't get a good scan. Monitor readings are off the scale. Be careful. Isaac, you did it. Hammond, do you read? Oxygen levels are returning to normal. Damn it. He's gone again. No sign of his rig anywhere. It's up to us now. I've got a plan to get off this ship. I've located an SOS beacon on the mining deck. If you can get down there and activate it, we might be able to send a distress call. Oh god. I don't know how much longer that target will hold. This may be our last chance of getting out of here alive, Isaac. There's an asteroid loaded up in the mining bay waiting to be smelted. If you attach the SOS beacon to it, you can launch it away from the ship to make a clean broadcast. The beacon's on the maintenance subdeck. You can launch the asteroid from the control room. <sighs> Damn, the control room is locked. It looks like they keep an emergency access key on the processing subdeck. Couldn't be easy, could it? I don't know how much more of this I can take. Beacon's on its way. All functions normal and broadcasting wideband. Now we just have to hope somebody's listening. I'll position the array receiver. I thought I saw my brother again. He waved to me like nothing was wrong. Okay. I should be able to leave this channel open. What? The comms array receiver isn't responding. Isaac, can you get back to the bridge? We need that array online or we can't receive signals from anyone responding to the beacon. <laughs> Things are looking up. A military ship just shocked in. The USM Valor. I don't know what it was doing out there. It must have gotten our distress signal. We can't talk to it until the comms array is fixed. I'm going to hack the door to communications for you. Get in there and find the comms control station.
This is USM Valor, widecasting on all frequencies to USG Ishimura in response to your SOS. We picked up your escape pod, number 47, and are en route to your position. This message will repeat every 30 seconds until you respond. USM Valor, this is Kendra Daniels on the USG Ishimura. Come in. Do not open the escape pod. USM Valor, this is Kendra Daniels on the USG Ishimura. Come in. Do not open the escape pod. Damn it! Respond! Why did they open the pod? Damn it. Oh my god. It's headed right for us. Isaac! Isaac! Fuck out of there! I wish I could just talk to someone. It's all falling apart here. I <coughs> Isaac! <coughs> Isaac, are you there? Thank God you're alright. I've been trying to reach you. Someone's been blocking my rig signal remotely. <coughs> A crash must have interrupted the signal block. Hammond? Where have you been? <laughs> Surviving. Barely. I found some med supplies and packed myself up. Listen. I'm calling aboard on the mission. Fuck the CEC and fuck the chain of command. We have to get the hell out of here. I think I've located a shuttle on the crew deck. The flight log says it needs a new singularity core, but we can probably salvage one from the Valor. I can see the tail end of it sticking out from the side of Ishimura. I'm headed down there now to find a way inside. I'll meet you there. Hammond out. Isaac, if what he says is true about the shuttle, we might have a chance of getting out of here. Head to the cargo bay and see if you can help Hammond. In his condition, he may not last long. Mr. Clark, I need to speak with you. My name is Terence Kine. Dr. Kine. Listen to me. There isn't much time. If you really can repair the shuttle, there is a better use for it than just running away. You must understand, the forces at work here are greater than you can imagine. If you leave now, you condemn all humanity. The planet will never stop, never rest unless the marker is returned. Don't you see? The church is wrong. This is all a trap. I've seen it. Please, you must help me. Is that it? You got it? Oh my god! You got it! That's the piece we need. Get to the crew deck. Isaac! Good, you made it inside. Listen, I just found the munitions log for the Valor. I don't think their presence here is a coincidence. They're not on reconnaissance and they're not on patrol. This ship is prepped for war. They're on a seek and destroy mission. Do you hear me? Isaac, I've lost him again. No signal from Hammond's rig. Find the Singularity Core and get the hell out of there. Isaac, I've located the shuttle Hammond found. <sighs> Shit. No good. That shuttle's brain dead. Someone removed the navigation cards. God knows why. There's three of them scattered around the deck. I'm downloading their locations. I can't access the doors from here, so you'll need a crew key. If you can find those parts, I think we can get that shuttle operational again. Mr. Clark, I really must speak with you. I'm very close to your position, and, and I know you want to hear what I have to say. <laughs> I can explain all this. So what happened? When you have the nav cards, I'll let you into the security station. We must talk. Hurry! Your time has come. No need to be frightened. No reason to fight. Many have gone before us. And now it's time for us to take the voyage together. Transcend death. The future take its course. Join me as I gaze upon the face of God. Mr. Clark, I'm approaching the shuttle hangar. You must, you must find your way to the cargo bay. 
the marker. It's being stored in there. There's a cargo loading lift there you can use to deliver the marker up to the hangar. Please, you must help me with this. It's the only way. It's on board. Please, come and join me. Together we can stop this hive mind. We can end this nightmare at last. Sorry, Isaac. I couldn't let him go through with it. I suppose I should thank you for finding the marker. We even managed without help from the USM Valor. Thank you for helping me find him, by the way. My department's been looking for this place for a long time. See what kind didn't know us? It was the government's mess to begin with. This whole planet is one big experiment. The marker? This <laughs> divine relic? Made by man. They reverse engineered it a couple of hundred years ago from the real marker, a true alien artifact recovered on Earth. They dug it up, studied it, and they made it their own. Then they brought it to Aegis 7 and activated it. And you've seen the result. The stuff of nightmares. They sealed the system, and no one would have been the wiser. But then the CEC blunders in and starts tearing the planet apart. The experiment was still alive. Kind was right about the hive mind. The marker would contain it, but that doesn't matter now, does it? I have the marker, and this entire system can go to hell. For what it's worth, you did a great job, Isaac. See you around. Or maybe not. Isaac, Nicole, I need you to help me. Help us, now. I'm, I'm in the flight control room. Please, Isaac, hurry. Please. I love you. Isaac, it's me. I wish I could talk to you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about everything. I wish I could just talk to someone. It's all falling apart here. I can't believe what's happening. It's strange. It's such a little thing. In the end, it all comes down to this. One little thing. I didn't want it to end like this. I really wanted to see you again. Just once. I loved you. I always loved you. <laughs>